Hi guys and welcome back to Eastwood. So let us continue where we left off. We're now heading home with our golden snapper. So let's see. Oh god, gotta make it back through here. Whoa. Okay. Um, is there a shortcut? I think we can manage with a pan. Break these in case there's any goodies inside. Oh. Didn't anticipate we get hit. Nice, two for one. Okay, Sam. No, oh, let's do it again. Reason. Uh, I wanted to use the gun, but okay. Oh, we got another one there as well. Just keep going, I guess. Mm, this might drop something. You never know. Sometimes it's worth taking them out, even if you can get past. first. Okay, die can found. Whoa, the bees. Oh, he's forgetting the damn bees. Okay. No, crab pots we can run past. They are definitely more trouble than they're worth. Okay, now hopefully this, you know, third time should be the charm. We will finally be able to praise dear old Lily with um, this meal. Okay. Um, I'm nervous we're never going to see the hot springs, so I do kind of want to go there. We're just going to take a little peek around. Board, yes. Oh, look at that. And we go through the city to the other side. Okay then. Ooh. Oh, one of those. There's a the controller's vibrating, so that's quite interesting. Let's get another story time. So we meet again. A big family used to live here, you know? And in that family, a young girl. One day her family suddenly disappeared. Mummy, mummy, she cried, running from room to room, but there was no one left. No one except a black cat, yawning silently in the middle of the hall. She wanted to leave and go to the city, but the words of her father held her back. No matter what happens, you mustn't leave. You must stay and protect the cellar, for there's something very important inside. And so she waited, and she waited, and she waited, until when someone finally did arrive, all they found was a young girl lying in front of the cellar, her body as cold as ice and a black cat yawning silently in the middle of the hall. You want to know what was in the cellar? Why, her family, of course. <laughs> Whoa. Dad? That was a bit of a, a mindfuck. Huh. Okay, I mean, disturbing. Sure. For sure it was disturbing. Okay, can we go in here yet? Yes, we can. 
Nothing else was outside. You so. Glass of milk for your sunny. Two glasses for ten. Mm, you bet. Oh. Cute. Okay. So the spa. Um. Okay, I get it. So we need to split. Do we? Don't think I don't know what you're doing, Sunny. That there's the woman's dressing room. I mean, I couldn't. It wouldn't let me go in here. And it's not letting me split or change character. Okay, I'm just gonna assume that we can't go here yet. Hopefully the game will tell us more. Okay, uh, New Dam City. Oh, is it interesting on that side? going to be brought back there very soon we've got to be coming to the end of chapter three oh, who's this dude it's nearly jennifer's birthday have you found a pearl yet um i mean yes we did find something spend it absolutely spend it i won't forget this here you are your reward oh nice 200 salt definitely worth it Okay. Um. Getting nervous about the chicken. You sure you don't have chicken, bro? Definitely ham. Thanks for dropping by. Um, ma'am. I'm here every day and I still make new discoveries. For instance, I've never eaten coconut powder. There's coconut powder before. Perhaps I'll give it a try. Wow, it's a small sword of making new discoveries every day. Alright. Um... That sign says chicken. Hmm. Okay. I'm not gonna get anywhere with the chicken. Let's have a, a chat to good old Chivas. You folks heading to Quake Valley? Don't let the name confuse you. Huh, more like Fake Valley. No idea what that is. C'est un frais de potoir. Okay. Oh, they did cook it. Don't you think this seems a little normal? Shouldn't be like more remarkable or something? I'm coming in. Please, yeah. Well, what do you think? So, so say something. I, I, I admit my defeat. Boss! We, we won! John, John, we won! This is truly a masterpiece in culinary design. The hard rock cheese, the fried shrooms, the snow plane cactus, and this, this fish. That's a Golden Valley Snapper. Golden Valley Snapper, remarkable, simply remarkable. This meal, it, it tastes like friendship. Well, you are our friendly. 
<laughs> you could easily conquer the city, you know that? You tell me then. What is it you want? Name your prize. I, I, I don't really want anything. Don't underestimate me, girl. There's not a single inch of this town my influence can't reach. Can I have some chicken? Or perhaps? You'd like to take my place to sit on top of the world? Boss! Quiet! I have lost, and I'll accept the consequences. Anything you wish, dear. Anything at all, and I will make it happen. Uh, mm, I I wish that you could come and eat dinner with us every day. And Jod can make you all kinds of crazy food you've never even seen before. I sound so sweet. <laughs> I take it back. I take it back. You couldn't just conquer the city. You would conquer the world. Ha 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 ha. Well, guess that just about wraps everything up, huh? We won! Oh, right, what's this? Oh, this? Lily left it for John. He said it was uh, a prize, you know, for winning. Looks like some kind of pan. But it's square. I've heard that some of the world's best chefs actually prefer this sort of pan. Really? Then I guess that means John should like it too. We done here? Oh, hey, that's a pretty nice pan. See, Izzy knows. This is the pan Lily gave John. And apparently, only amazing chefs can use it. Appropriate that it's going to John, then. Nice, another weapon. Oh, the pan leveled up. Nice. Oh, finally our pan leveled up. You know, there's something different about John now, come to think of it. No doubt a result of our first big win. Alva's laboratory proves victorious. I wonder if, like, all the little, like, mini animations and stuff will change now that we have a different pan. Not sure I'd describe it as a big win. Let's wait until we find a cure before we say that, huh? And a victory deserves a celebration. And there's your true motive. <laughs> peep your peep is at this. What's this, huh? What's this? A ticket to... Ah, a ticket to the hot springs. We knew it. Hot springs? What's hot springs? Can you drink it? I think you'll be able to answer your own question after you see it. Meet us outside town and all your questions will be answered. Okay, well straight back to the hot springs with us then. Okay. You know what my question's gonna be. Is it a new day yet? Is it a new day? With new items in the grocery store? Is it? Yes, oh my goodness, we got the chicken! Oh, we got the chicken. Okay, do we have everything else? Yes, yes, yes. Thanks for dropping by. Okay. I wonder if we should do this now or later. Um, we should probably do it now. Mm, oh, I'm getting, I'm getting overwhelmed. Okay. So we're gonna go cook up there by the carnival. So for those of you um, who don't know, what we're currently trying to do is we're trying to make the meal. Um, it's gonna make our friend whose name I forgot stronger. And you get the meal from the jazz club. That's where you get the recipe, um, which I think that's what we literally just passed. I think we literally just passed the jazz club. It's one of those buildings. Uh, I think. Oh wait, no, it's the small purple one with the green and pink door. That's the jazz club. Okay. So we got the recipe over here. It was for a, a diet. What's it called? Diet set. And we need a lobster, an egg, and a chicken. 
Oops, I hit the back button. Okay. Lobster. Egg. Where did chicken go? Chicken. Cool, let's start cooking. Um, quality's not gonna matter, but we'll try. I mean, I'll try very hard, clearly. <laughs> but, you know, two out of three. And the pan does look the same, but from this angle, you know, it's a little deceptive. Oh no. We made sushi platter. That's not right. Okay. So. Hmm. Egg, lobster, chicken. Egg, lobster, chicken. Diet set. Start cooking. Okay, is yellow this? Wow, that was really bad. But we still got two in a row. Cool, there we go. Diet set. So, clearly you need to do them in that very specific order. Otherwise, you're going to get a different meal. Okay, very important. Okay. What's that? You found a dish that'll make you stronger? Quick, give it to me. The, this is the dish that'll make me stronger? But it, it barely even looks edible. No, no. Dwayne, now's not the time to be thinking of things like that. Remember, if it's for Lin Lin, you've got to eat anything. Oh, wow. Yo, over here, John. Recognize me now? It's your man, Dwayne. It's all thanks to you, my man. The bulging biceps, the ripped pecs, my darling little Linny Poo. Oh, Dwayneykins. Linny Poo. Dwayneykins. Yes, we did it. Hey, and that gave us a hot orb. Nice. Cool. Oh, well, I'm glad we did that. Okay, I'm wondering if there's any other... Side? Ooh. Haven't had that happen before. Pretty cool, though. Um. Why does this look like it has a doorway? And that doesn't do anything, right? If you turn taps on and off. I don't think there's a, a way to get in there, do you? No? Okay, go check the news. Okay, roomable. Um, well, we've completed this one. Does it say anything different? Went to friend of a friend of a friend. He'd been exercising non stop type of scoring. Girlfriend only the more pound he shared. The JK became. Okay. So, what I'm wondering is if for both of those other items, if we finish them, would we um, get a hot orb as well? Because there's still the trash talking. Um. 
and then there's the statues one and we found four statues so far huh here's something's perfume set of fine eyes and never I have never seen my ladies care to tantalize your paws with the sultry smooth texture of my hot off the pot patent pending temblor jelly our jelly comes straight from the slippery surface of the reclusive temblor fish according to our research the temblor fish is one of the only fish who can move and breathe on land and it's all thanks to this ch -ch jelly which boasts water retentive properties likes of which have never been re replicated in over-the-counter cosmetics you can't go wrong with temple jelly when it comes to supple, moisturized, and simply fantastic looking skin. But it's from a fish, can't say I fancy the idea of lathering that all over me. Indeed, and the packaging is a bit different. Whatever, let's go. Wanna grab a drink at the Lightning Max before I before I get started with my shift? Daniel, do it now. We're right. Oh dear, how could this be? A surprising new development puts me in quite a pickle. What? What is it? What happened? I apologize, ladies, but I have to just received a piece of startling news. It seems a woman from Uptown has just offered to buy our entire stock of Temple Jelly. I'm afraid we won't be able to sell you any. And for this, I'm overcome with shame. I beg for your forgiveness. Woman from Uptown? Wait, you don't mean Mrs. Sun, do you? It's gotta be. Last I heard, she's got a whole stockpile of the fanciest cosmetics. Then... I do apologize, my ladies, but my motorized counterpart is correct. We must get the shipment to our customer post haste. You, uh, don't think you'd be willing to part with just a few bottles, do you? Yes, we were here first, after all. I am afraid that would be impossible. A code of business stipulates that. Yes, 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 it's decided then. If it's only a few bottles, then I see no harm. As these gentle ladies said themselves, they were here first. But what about our code of business? How fantastic. Guess you ain't such a bad guy after all. Do tell us next time you get your hands on anything new, hmm? Of course, of course. Well, 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 William. Ho ho, hail to the conquering hero, as it were, if it isn't her royal highness's intrepid heroine, Sam, and her loyal chef extraordinaire, John. How smells the grass upon the other side, hmm? Now that you've squashed the city's imp imperious sovereign between your toes. There weren't any toes, and there's certainly no squashing. Lee's our friend now. Ha ha ha, friend. Oh, that is truly rich. Do you think there would be anyone in New Damn City brave enough to call him a friend? Though I suppose if it were anyone, it would be you. Oh, I heard the two of you took down Lee. It's decided then I absolutely must write a song for you. Kill the song. Alright, we're here are the kids. I haven't caught up with some of these guys in a while. Oh, Sam. Sam's here, guys. Well, look at you it is, and still willing to hang out with us common folk, eh? You guys sure are the talk of the town now. Yeah, even my mom was talking about you. Did you know that some bloke finally beat that Lee? I saw him, I did, over at the market. What a hunk. Why can't your father be more like him? Haha, <laughs> sounds just like her. Oh, right, do you want to play around of Earthborn with us? Mm, maybe next time. Don't tell me you got another mission. How cool. Just don't forget us, okay? You're our priest after all. Yeah. At some point I'll try the Earthborn game. Um right now, just on a, on a small quest looking for a trash can. I guess this is the market. Yeah. It might have new stuff. Um. Mm, one fireman wouldn't kill us to get. And you. What do you have? Oh, she just like says they're around. Okay, we know fish heads, fish tails. Which fruit you got? No, we've seen those already. Um, and you use all like the same snacks every day. I see a new woman there though. Yeah. Seen that. Um, Timber Jelly is supposed to be amazing for your skin. Skin stuff's expensive though. You should really spend the money on Ned's lube oil instead. 
Oh, her husband's a robot. That kind of lube. Gotcha. All right. Okay, well, that seems to be that, right? Because if I'm correct, we're down at the bottom. Yeah, so they'll take us out of town. Um, so do you have a fun anecdote for us? It is when the waves recede that the true storm begins. Cool. Okay. Oh, wait. Look over here. There's another little statue. So we meet again. Let me ask you something. This alley, pretty normal looking, yeah? Well, you wouldn't be the first to think so. Picture this, the sun's going down on a warm summer's day. A kid saying goodbye to his friends, heading home for the night, just like any other day. Anxious to eat his mom's freshly grilled burgers, he decides to take a shortcut. Oh, how gloriously cool the alley feels after the muggy streets. So he starts going faster, his little shoes slapping the pavement. And as he runs, the alley seems to shrink. Tighter and tighter, the sides of the alleyway are closing in until he has to turn sideways just to keep moving forward. But the only thing on his mind is his mother's burgers. Faster, he thinks, I need to hurry. And so he keeps pushing and squeezing, inching along until he can push and squeeze an inch along no more. Some say you can still hear him unable to so much as turn his head as he calls out for his mom again and again. I gotta say, I never thought anyone stick around for my stories. You're a pretty okay guy. Here you got time? Pop by my cemetery downtown. You got time? Pop by my cemetery downtown. Hmm, what kind of downtown? Couldn't possibly be in here, could it? Hmm. Could even this way. Okay, it's not that. It's something else. New Dam City. By my cemetery downtown. Okay. We've done this one already. So nothing to do with the cemetery. Yeah, we must have. It's not prompting us anymore. Okay. Hmm. stone unturned this is princess avenue this is midtown This is just city outskirts. Check the map. Hmm. This area up here? Oh, we've been there. Okay. Well, there is also... What the heck and Bob is that? There is also an icon... Over here, right? That's for the subway. Okay, well... We best be on our way. Good 
go check it out. New Dam City Subway Service. Where would you like to go? To the Hot Springs. Please wait on the platform. Oh, almost perfect uh, lining up over there. Well, here is our friend painting. Hello again, my friends. To think I'd find a place like this outside the city. Fascinating. Reminds me a lot of my own village, actually. Simply marvelous. Oh, hello, friends. We're here. Then let's go to the hot springs. Wait a sec. Let's chat to Izzy first. Oh, okay. Izzy doesn't have anything to say. So let's get going. Welcome. 20 ahead. You want milk? There's going to be an extra 10. Mrs. Fumi. Oh, if it isn't Princess Alva. Look, dear. Look who's here. Oh, we. Ain't you a sight for sore eyes? Considered on the house today, little missy. We've got free tickets from Lee. You. You're the ones that won the bet against Lee, aren't you? Hehe, <laughs> in the flesh. Come on, Sam, this way. Aren't you coming, John? Your father needs to use the other door, dear. Last one in's a rotten egg. Hey, no fear. Those black things. Something just doesn't sit right with me. And the monsters outside town. They've almost seemed restless lately. Can't help but feel like something bad's about to happen. Izzy, bring the shampoo, will ya? Tomorrow, I'll go. Make sure that old fan's still in working order. Izzy, come on. You too, John. Hurry up. The water's great. Ho ho ho. Who knew I'd be getting such a lovely show today? <laughs> Dear. Hmm. Suspicious. Hmm. I wonder what's up next. Let's take a good look around. Can we go out here? No, we cannot. Okay, well, I guess that's it then. Anyone else coming out? Excuse me, here everyone is. They still need a bit more time, I believe. Why not take a walk out in the yard? Hmm. Well, this is going to end well. Stop right there. No one leaves this building without having a glass of milk first. Can't call yourself a son of New Damn City without a cool, tall glass of the white stuff. This one's on me, son. Alright, let me guess. He's healing us up. Yeah, it would have healed us. Oh. Increase the max heart. Nice. Now you can call yourself a true citizen of New Dam City. Okay. Uh, 
I trust this? Hey, Mr. Sonic. Help a bot currently in auto mode. Priority set to charge battery. Help a bot is charging. Signal approaching. Reconnecting to Elder. Exiting auto mode. Goodbye, lab assistant John. And then, and then, boom, Daniel caught the mini pickup right out of the air, he did. Mini pickup. Oh. A T3 AT Tomoto mini pickup. It was Tomoto's first ever mass produced vehicle. Its inline four cylinder engine perfectly <laughs> complements its four speed manual transmission. And it was one of the manufacturer's rare white models to boot. That's. that's. genius, Sam. You're so smart. Hehe, <laughs> I just learned it myself. Light of the moon illuminates the path back to the city. This is the first time Sam has been able to admire the sky since reaching the surface. And what a beautiful sight it is. So big and vast it could swallow her right up. But there's something disappointing about it too. This isn't just another dome, higher than the one in Pukrak Isle, but still, what could be on the other side of that dome? She'll have to ask Elva. Elva knows everything. Everything there is to know. Ooh, dream come true. Alright guys, I'm going to be ending this part off over here. I hope that you enjoyed. If you did, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.